Today's craft is a gingerbread house, and although we can't eat it, it's really cute and it's fun to make. Well, if you can't bake a gingerbread house, you can make one out of paper like this, and it's kind of cute. So let's see, let's get started. We do have a template online if you would like to download it and print it out, and that would help with all the different parts, but you could also just kind of eyeball it and copy it if you want to. Um, the pieces are not that complicated. Um, I have traced our template. I cut it out and um, the first piece I cut out was a house, a shape like a house. Um, I cut it out on brown paper. You can cut it on white paper and color, color it brown if you want to. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little bit of snow on the roof. And the way I did that was I cut um, pieces from a doily. So here, this is the doily I had and I just trimmed along um, the edge, uh, right right here along the edge, like this, very kind of carefully, and um, got like a piece of it, and then just trimmed it like this, and then um, I'm going to just kind of um, line that up and use a piece of it to make it look kind of like snow on our roof. So I'm going to trim it kind of to measure the, 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 uh, the same length as the roof. Um, and then I'm going to just glue that right on. So a little bit of glue right along the edge of the roof. And the next thing I want to do is um, cut out the door, which is just sort of um, kind of a horseshoe shape. Um, but before I, I cut that out, and then I'm going to color it in, and you can do whatever you want. The easiest thing for me to do was just sort of make it kind of a candy cane shape, um, a candy cane design. So I'm just going to kind of color, uh, you know, red and red lines. So just quickly do some red lines across it to make it look sort of like a candy cane. And then maybe throw in some green lines to make it a little more colorful. But again, kids, you are probably much more um, artistic than I am and probably have great imagination. So color anything you want or put stickers or put gems or anything you have around that you would like to use to decorate your door of your gingerbread house would be fine. Okay, and then take some glue and put glue around your doorway like this. And put your doorway right there in the middle. Okay, so now you have the doorways on the house, okay? And the next thing you wanna do is um, maybe put some candy canes like I had in my sample here. There were some candy canes on there. So um, maybe you wanna just, I've already colored mine, so I'm just going to glue those on um, the edge. And now we want to put some colorful um, things on our gingerbread house. So I've just cut out colorful um, circles. You can see them here. They're just uh, paper circles that um, I cut out um, to kind of make it look like um, the Neko candies a little bit that you usually put on. And you can do them any way you want. I just kind of put them all over. I didn't really line them up like roof shingle or anything like you would normally have on a um, on a uh, gingerbread house. It's just sort of to give the idea of it. So you can just put them anywhere you want. Just glue them on, all over, all different colors. Jingle bells swing and jingle bells ring. 
there you have your house is all decorated and you can continue to decorate any way you would like. Hope you had a good time making our gingerbread house. Happy holidays. Now the jingle hop has begun. Jingle